Thank you, Piyush. Now we're going to take some t a few minutes here and take some questions from the audience. And just as a reminder, please use the chat box to the right of the screen to send in your questions. And uh, to, to get us started, uh, I, I have a question for you here, uh, Piyush. So what trends are you seeing uh, across your financial services customers that are really driving towards a more comprehensive data management strategy? I think one of the biggest challenges is led by consumers wanting to have more access to their data beyond just the walls of the banks that they work with. So when you look at, you know, and I think about myself, I say, okay, if I wanted a mortgage or if I wanted to do something with my personal finances or if I wanted guidance on, you know, uh, financial management, why do I need to give bank statements or other things to other people that I'm talking to? Why couldn't that be shared? where I could easily make that happen or facilitate without having to create PDF docs and attachments into emails, right? And that's a simple example, but there's so many things like that. And if you, you know, that example of Venmo is a classic example, it's become um, such a simple and, and important aspect, you know, Venmo, Zeal, these payment sharing platforms um, that people use Zoom as an international payment mechanism, you know, that allows you to instantaneously transfer money uh, to people around the world. I mean, these are things that make life easier, but they're driven by consumers' needs to say, hey, give me more of the ability to share my own data. Interesting. Interesting. Thank you very, very much. Um, and I guess in the final minute we have here, we did have one other quick question. I mean, from a, from a market adoption curve standpoint, how, how far do you feel you know, financials are going to make open banking kind of more of a de facto standard at, the, at a global level? I think it's, it's inevitable. I think um, we are on that journey and we've really accelerated that journey. If you looked at that, uh, the Berlin Group and what they're doing around payment services, that's just one example. Mm -hmm. um, there's many, many others like that that are taking place both regionally and globally in terms of driving more open platforms that can be leveraged. But the biggest key there is security, right? The, the biggest challenge is how do you mitigate risk? How do you protect the data that you're being asked to be a smart steward of and do so effectively? So it's a balancing act, but it's one that we see that um, is definitely high on the adoption curve. It's something that I believe every institution is actively in the midst of incorporating and driving um, in some shape or form. Um, so absolutely uh, high adoption. Great, great. Well, well thank you, Piyush, for joining us today and for the folks.